If you've been around Christians for any length of time, I'm sure you've heard the phrase, God only gives you what you can handle. Is that even in the Bible? Let's talk about that. Hey guys, Jeff here from That Bold Life, your weekly source for Christian education, motivation, and inspiration. Throughout my life, I've went through some pretty hard times where I've faced some pretty hard situations, where I've faced things that I couldn't quite explain or I couldn't comprehend, or in the moment, they were so painful that I didn't even want to think about it. Sometimes I even questioned where God was in that moment. And I've heard this one phrase several times, God only gives us what we can handle. You might be shocked to know it doesn't even say that anywhere in the Bible. Actually, what I believe most people get it confused with is 1 Corinthians 10, 13, where Paul says, No temptation has overtaken you except what is common to mankind. And God is faithful. He will not let you be tempted beyond what you can bear. But when you are tempted, he will also provide a way out so that you can endure it. So I think a lot of people read this verse where it says, specifically that you will be not tempted beyond what you can bear. It never says that God won't give you more than you can handle. Now I want to tackle the second part of that. I really don't like how in the beginning, since it's not even biblical, that it says God only gives you what you can handle. So you're telling me when my mom was sick and passed away, God gave that to me? So you're telling me in these painful moments while my child is in the hospital, while my marriage is on the rocks, while my parents getting a divorce, while I'm getting laid off from my job, that God gave that to me? That doesn't sound like a loving God at all. See, that's that's the first problem I have with this statement, God only gives you what you can handle, is you're suggesting this pain, this trial, the struggle that I'm in at this very moment was given to me by God? Well, that goes against the very characteristic of God. I don't believe that's who God is. Because I can assure you, this situation that I'm in, this problem I'm facing, this trial I'm going through, this burden, I can't handle it anyway. So to say that God only gives us what we can handle, first of all, I don't believe that God gave it to me. And second, in this moment, I can't handle it. In fact, I believe the Bible says the opposite. If we read the writings of Jesus, one of my favorite passages all through the Bible is Matthew 11:28 28 through 30, where Jesus says, Come to me, all of you who are weary and carry heavy burdens, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you. Let me teach you because I am humble and gentle at heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy to bear, and the burden I give you is light. So when we read the actual message of Jesus himself, the words he speaks out of his own mouth, he never says that I won't give you more than you can bear. He actually says that those of you who are weary and carry heavy burdens, those of you that are hurting, those of you that are broken, those of you that are facing a situation that you can't handle, that is too much for you, he says that when you can't carry your burdens and when it's more than you can handle, He says, come to me and I will give you rest. You see, I believe that we are communal beings, that we were never meant to carry the stress, the problems, the circumstances, the pain, the trials, the situations that we face every single day. We were never meant to carry those alone, but instead we have a loving Father in heaven who says, give those burdens to me, child. It's more than you can handle, I know it is, and I'm telling you to put it on my back. Rely on me, trust in me, give me that problem, give me that circumstance, give me that, and I will in turn give you rest, and I will give you peace. I will remove those burdens, because I am a loving God. You're not intended to go through that alone. You're not intended to face that alone. You can't handle it, but I can. Give it to me. That's the God we serve. We don't serve some malicious God who's just throwing burdens at you just to see if you crumble under the pressure. The God we serve, the God of Christianity is a loving, just God that says, child, when it's more than you can take, give it to me. Give it to me and I'll give you rest. My yoke is easy, my burden is light. Give it to me, child. I wanna encourage you, whatever you're facing today, 
whatever you're up against, whatever burdens you have, whatever pain you're feeling, whatever suffering you're going through. There is a God that loves you. He didn't give you this problem. The world gave you that problem. The world will give you more than you can handle. He's there to offer to take the stress and the burden off you that if you just give him that problem, he is faithful and just to provide for you. That if you give him that struggle, if you give him that pain, he loves you enough that he'll take that burden off you. You no longer have to stress about it because he is in control. Trust in him. He loves you. All right, guys, I want to thank you for checking out my video. If you enjoyed today's content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I release content just like this every single Friday. So go ahead and hit that bell icon too. And that way you can be notified every time I release a video. All right, guys, keep living that bold life.